Well, Valentina, congratulations on your win. Uh, I think coming into this fight, even the people that thought you would win, nobody was picking you by arm bar. So uh, talk about you know, how the fight unfolded and just how you feel about this victory. I feel very, very good, great feeling, but uh, more, uh, I was sure about the victory because I had very uh, strong training camp. I trained very hard and for this fight I was very motivated and very concentrated. I was telling before the fight that I don't care like about one step and I don't want to think about the future because I'm really focused on this fight. And I knew that uh, I have to win this. Uh, that's why I didn't have choice like, oh, maybe I will lose. No, I didn't have it in my mind. I only think about victory. I think th this would help me to do my best. Can you talk about the game plan? Because, of course, we knew that she was going to clinch you and try to take you down, but you were the one that initiated the takedowns in the opening round, which I think was surprising. Was that something that you were planning on doing, or was it something you just reacted on the fly? Uh, it's, like I said before, I'm martial artist. I'm not only striker, like people said. I'm complete fighter. I'm MMA fighter. That's why I choose every time tactic depends on my opponent. E what tactic will help me? So I just keep going with this tactic. But um, how you can see my record, like uh, MMA record, I have few submissions. So it was not for me like um, to start MMA from zero. No, I was in MMA already many years ago. I fought 2002, 2003, five, six. But in that time, um, uh, we didn't have a lot of opponents in MMA. No, so not much girls and that's why the reason why I was dedicated more Muay Thai and K1 and uh, when uh, 2010 uh, the world of female MMA start grew up like extremely uh, we back to Muay Thai and MMA and now we know that you're going to get to face Amanda Nunes again um, how does it go differently this time around does it being a five round fight change things because a lot of people thought it would have the first time and uh when would you like to have that fight? I'm very excited for this fight. I know that it will be a totally different fight with totally differ different result. And how I said before, uh, Amanda won not because she was stronger than me. It was because maybe I give her um, some kind like um, a little bit reason to uh, take this victory. But I know for sure I was training hard all this time and every fight make me much stronger and much stronger. And uh, that's why I know I will do my best uh, to take this belt when from you, her. Anytime. I'm ready right now. <laughs> What were you more? Um, what are you more proud of? Your performance tonight or your dance moves after the fight was over? <laughs> uh, about dance, um, it's my the music with uh, uh, my workout music. It's named Lesginka. Usually, when I had uh, mu my Muay Thai competitions, I every time was work to the ring with the music and with the dance together. But in MMA fights, I uh, like more focus on the fight. And after the fight, if it's like a very good fight, I can dance. <laughs> and uh, talking about being able to submit uh, Pena tonight, it doesn't make it any more satisfying, given what you have been saying all week, that people look at you as just a striker. Does it make the win that much sweeter? Uh, you know, I can say exactly about Pena. She's a good fighter. She's wild. But I'm a master. <laughs>